world, Topless Cat Lady here, and I just want to do a pretty quick video, sort of a rant video, I guess. I haven't really done a rant video before, but it's in regards to the World Health Organization recently publishing that processed meats and most meats have been linked with cancer, and how nobody wants to pay attention to it. And it's fucking ridiculous. There's a good video up right now comparing a video made in the 60s after the World Health Organization listed cigarettes as a carcinogen interviewing people on the streets and someone else interviewing people on the streets about meat. And it was huge similarities because it's new and people don't really want to believe it. But now, of course, everyone knows that smoking is linked to lung cancer and people are ignoring the WHO's recommendations on meat because they don't believe it, which is absurd because to publish something as controversial as meat causing cancer and going against big beef and dairy industries is huge. This is a huge step on the WHO because the meat and dairy industry have like unlimited resources and have unlimited money and legal resources and they shut people up Quick. I do not think the World Health Organization took this lightly and was like, oh, maybe it causes cancer. You know, we'll just throw it in there because it's possible. No, I guarantee you they went through every minute detail, every study, did their own research and found out that yes, eating processed meats and red meats is linked to cancer. And the fact that people are just throwing this out the window is absolutely absurd. I was watching one of my guilty pleasure YouTube channels the other day and the mom of the family, she was cooking like beef or something for dinner and she's like, I feel like I'm, I don't know if I should feed this to my kids because of what the who said, but you know, maybe just in moderation. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and call this child abuse. Would you let a child smoke cigarettes in moderation? No. No, no one in their right fucking mind would let a child smoke cigarettes in moderation. If meat is now on the same level as asbestos, tobacco, and arsenic, and we're feeding it to children, oh, but only in moderation. That is the most absurd thing I have ever heard. When people realize that it is at the same level as smoking cigarettes, it will be child abuse. And so anyone out there who thinks that this is all just a load of shit, you are so fucking wrong. <laughs> you are so unbelievably wrong. Very soon, the majority of people are gonna see eating meat as the same as eating rat poison and smoking cigarettes. Unfortunately, there's still gonna be those few who will eat it because they don't give a fuck about themselves, you know, just as the people who smoke cigarettes. Don't be a fucking idiot and think that you can just eat it in moderation. Would you allow yourself to inhale asbestos in moderation? Would you allow yourself to eat rat poison in moderation? No, we should not be feeding these foods to our children. We should not be putting these foods in our bodies. We should do be doing everything possible to remain healthy to have a long life, have a long happy life, which is much more easily obtained when you're eating a vegan diet because it, you automatically feel so much better because of what you're putting into your body. There's absolutely no reason to eat meat this day and age, especially when it comes to your health and the environment. It's just not fucking worth it. I don't care what your excuses are, the taste, the convenience, it's all bullshit because you can do all the same shit and you just make it vegan and then on top of that you feel really good about yourself because you're not contributing to cancer or the destruction of our planet. Please, people, open your fucking eyes. Actually read the WHO's recommendations and stop feeding meat to your children because you wouldn't let them smoke. If you found this video helpful and you think someone else might also find it helpful, please feel free to share it. If you enjoyed it, do give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe because it's free. And remember, be proactive, make a change in this world, go vegan, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Mm -hmm.